Yo, what is up, guys? TK Games here. Bring you guys an awesome video on the first episode of my Let's Play series with Plants vs. Zombies. Alright, guys, I've done the second one, but I'm gonna put that series on hold like I did in my previous video. And we're gonna have to do the first one before the second one because you guys won't get what the second one is. Really, it's the same concept. So, we're a new user, so we're gonna name myself um, TK Games. And I wanna go case G, I gotta have an uppercase. It's TK Games, return, and then boom, we're gonna go into adventure mode because that's what we're supposed to. And we'll probably do some other stuff. Pop Gap Games or um, presents. Oh, this game! I love this game so much. This game's my favorite. Oh my gosh! There's so much stuff you guys can do in this game. So let's see. Here we go. All right. So T Game Games House. There it is. There are the zombies, guys. And the first wave of zombies. Here we go. Game Center pops up, which means that we won't have any lag. All right. We're gonna have to uh, go through the tutorial, unfortunately, guys. All right. That's okay. Alright, this stuff's stupid because you have to go through, um, you know, this is the first one, so, you know, people, if you play the second one, then really there's not a lot, so you're just gonna put this. But this is just a tutorial one, so now we're just gonna see the zombies, and I love the, I love the first one because, um, PopCap really, um, um, sponsored, uh, not really sponsored, they made the game and then they owned it, but now EA is taking over the second one, but I don't have a problem with, but I like PopCap to have, um, on the center, because EA, as soon as you, um, uh, as soon as you open plans for zombies 2 it says ea which i want popcap to pop up not not um second i want to pop up first so really this is a tutorial i wish they had a fast forward button like the second one but of course they don't so this is just um this is you know this is the same concept but i like the second first one because they've got a really it's not as long of course but you know it's pretty it'll take up a little while so all right so about the new channel guys um i might be uploading some other stuff besides plans for zombies as you guys might you know Get more stuff so we get now we get the sunflower and now boom we get that shiny sunflower and the sunflower gives us sun which is pretty cool okay that's my other weather channel and i, I got i gotta do something about that so plant t games house of course we get the same thing but just more zombies and we're just gonna use the sunflower and we get three roads of craft instead of two uh, instead of one so this is really just a tutorial and the sunflower gives us sun on oh, an extremely important plant yep let's do that and it gives us sun and i like the second I, I like how the sunflower dances it's pretty cool so usually I do the thing, I usually put the sunflowers in the back, um, just because it's normally how I do it. So I got, I got to wait for that to reload, and boom, now we got all the sunflowers we need. Now we got to uh, plant some pea shooters. And I love the music in the first game. The first game had the best music, has the best. Second one has pretty good music, but this first one always has the best. Let's see which, okay, it's come down, of course. And yeah, this is, um, you guys can tell us it's a pretty simple game, but once we get into those hard levels, it's going to be pretty fun. And it's gonna get pretty hectic because this is just a um, beginning kind of tutorial kind of thing. So you guys, um, about Clash of Clans, I really just uh, grown out of it. Um, just no, not just because it's like a young person game, just because um, I just don't find it fun anymore. I don't know why. It's just that I just don't play it anymore really. And every time I do play it for a video, that's the only time I really play the game. So I really was like, uh, I, I like pl I play Plants vs Zombies a lot, so I want to focus my channel on there. So you guys might like it, you guys might not like it, but you know, it's my decision, I'm gonna make it, and yeah, so, we're getting this, and yeah, so, so, we're just gonna put more in, the cone has zombies, they take two pea shooters, really, to take them down, because, because the zombies are rock faster, so yeah, let's see, that's, they got some pretty awesome music, but I like the, anim the animation on the second one's better, of course, but you know, I like the orchestra they use, it's kind of like Plants for not plans for zombies like Super Mario Galaxy, but you know it's got a different tone and it actually matches really good. Boom, there it goes. And yeah, this really, we're gonna really gonna we're not gonna make this too, too long of an episode, but just not too short of an episode. So yeah, we're gonna get re ready for the final wave, and here it comes, guys. And we're gonna we're not gonna do three rows of grass. We're gonna have five rows soon. See, there's no oh yeah, there's no cone head, so really. You don't really need you don't really need any like particular amount of pea shooters, but you know it's great to have them. And yeah, let's see. They only give you 25 sun. The first one get the first uh, the second game gives you 50 sun. If I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure they do. But yeah, guys, hope you guys are enjoying the Plants vs Zombies gameplay. I really like it, and you guys will tell why. And we got the cherry bomb. The cherry bomb's awesome. Um, just because it blows up a ton of zombies if you're in a tight pickle. Blows up to all zombies in an area. All right, next level, and we're gonna have five rows of grass. Finally, this is, and we got conehead zombies. So yeah, this is gonna be pretty uh, hectic, and we're gonna have five. Oh, we only have. 
Okay, we only have three still. I thought we had five, but we'll stop. We, we won't um, make this too long an episode, but you know, you guys might like to be playing this game. You guys know the channel's sending around it. Uh, let's see, let's do sunflowers. We gotta do our three sunflowers, and we'll start playing pea shooters. And then, you know, if we get a tight pickle, then we'll have to use the cherry bombs. But we might eat, we'll probably use them for fun. Alright, let's see. Brains. <laughs> Alright, let's see. And there goes the pea shooter, and now he's gonna go down. And when we get to those hard levels where it's at night, we're gonna need to rely on our mushrooms, which we'll get back in. So I'll really probably wrap it up for this episode um, after this. When I'm not, I'm not like one of those guys I'll play for 40 minutes. But yeah, so let's see. You got, oh, I planned the wrong place. Gosh darn it. All right, we gotta wait for the sun. Where's the fast forward button, please? <laughs> All right, let's see. We got that. And boom, there's 100 sun. We gotta get four. We gotta get a lot of sun. You know, I'm not playing two rows of sun because there's no really point because I need because that's going to cost a lot more. Even though it makes a profit, probably, I'm not going to risk it. But once we get five rows, we're going to have to find some flowers. Five some flowers. It's going to be pretty cool. All right, we got to decide where the first cone head. Well, screw it. We'll just put, we'll plant another one. So let's see. More sun, cherry bombs, and yeah. So this is, so, so far, it's a pretty, you know, it's a pretty easy game right now. But it's, 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 it's kind of hard. The second one's extremely hard. Just not going to lie. The second one is actually really hard. In my opinion, um, you guys can tell that I skip levels in the second one just because um, it's just impossible sometimes for me to like do it on camera. It'll just take me like 50 minutes probably to do one. But there's a conehead zombie. The conehead zombie take 20 uh, shots. Um, I know 10. And it takes 10 of them for the other one. But yeah, there's 20 shots. Um, but yeah, so it's a lot easy. It, it's just you know I like this. I like the second one because they have a lot of new content. This one's just a nice. Um, refreshing the memory when the games were so good. The games are really good still, of course. You know, Clash of Clans, I used to play, but don't play anymore. So let's see. Boom, boom, and yeah. There we go. And now we should be taking care of the Conehead Zombies, and the cone should be falling off any second. Boom, there it goes down. And so far, it's pretty easy level. And we'll, we'll save up for, um, we'll save up our Cherry Bomb. We'll save up for a Cherry Bomb. That's going to be pretty cool. Let's see. All right. Here we go. We'll save for a cherry bomb for the final wave to tell you, show you how how it uh, goes. It's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome plan, I think, in my opinion. Here we go. Here comes the final wave. All right, let's see. Um, all right, we're gonna use the cherry bomb. Where are we gonna use it? Here it comes. There you go. Yeah, come on. <laughs> this is pretty easy, as you guys can tell. There we go. Cherry bomb. Wham! It just kills all the zombies. And boom, there goes the wave. And we got the walnut. The walnut is like a protective plant pretty valuable in my opinion but you know we have a lot of plants here blocks off zombies and protects your plants next level and we got more of these and this the, the beach low let me tell you the pool levels are extremely hard now we're gonna get the five rose plants done i'll wrap it up for this episode so this time i think we have not mistaken we have still a one way i don't know i really haven't played this game in since like 2011 so it's been a long time uh so yeah it's been a really long time since I played this game, and it was the best game I've ever played when I was young. This game brings back so many memories of how awesome it was. It got console, of course. So now we're gonna stop playing P, um, stop playing Sunflowers, and we're gonna start actually make, actually put, um, putting this money to work. Put some peas, and they don't move as fast. The second one, they move really fast. Boom. There we go. And I only have to do 25 of so That's pretty stupid and bogus, I think, in my opinion. So really what I do is I just wait for the second zombie to come through and then I plant that and then I'll plant the second one. Alright, let's see. Oh, it's second, it's same one. Okay, I can just plant another sunflower just because, you know, they won't have another zombie for a little while, but you know, they'll come pretty soon. Where's the next zombie we're going to put plant? Go. Alright, let's see. Until I see his head. Where's his head? There he is. Alright, let's see. I kind of like the second game, Zoomer Galaxy. It's a little harder than the first one. But the first one, this, the first one does have some challenges, not going to lie, but you know, the boss is ridiculous. It's, you know, you can hit, you can be in your first try, but the Pogo Stick Zombies, which we'll get into the later episodes, we'll put one right there. And yeah, so it's going to take a while for this zombie to go down. Da -da -da. Need to uh, put a walnut right there. I'll show you guys really how it works. They just really eat the walnut, and that'll be it. That's how it goes. 
You just put one right there and it'll start eating it. It'll take them a while to eat it, really. So really there's no worries of, you know, that. So you just do that. And now he's going to go down pretty fast. And the walnut's going to stay up and it takes him a while to eat that. Um, so yeah. He didn't even get, he didn't even damage it really. So it takes him a while. But the bucket head zombies, which we'll get in the next episode, are actually really pain in the butt. Not in my opinion. Okay, I'll put a second right there. In the final wave, we'll use a cherry guy just because he's really fun to use and he'll get rid of waves really fast. Pretty free fill. Boom. It's, it's a pretty solid strategy when you put walnuts on, in front of, you know, they uh, will get distracted with eating it and stuff. It's a pretty, pretty useful tool. Let's see. Let's see. Alright. Boom right there. And, oh crap, I put in the wrong place. Shoot. Alright, come on. I'm gonna put a walnut right here. To stall them and stuff, so yeah. Alright, boom, the sun's gonna come out. There. And now he's, they should, he's gonna start eating it, but he won't finish it, of course. But yeah, it seems like the zombies go down a lot faster than the second game. The second game, it takes forever, and there's a ton of zombies and a ton of crap going on. So really, it's gonna we're just gonna save up for... Um, we, we already saved up the cherry guys, so yeah. Alright, let's see. It's gonna be going down. Let's see, boom. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna put a zombie in the middle, why not? There we go. Where should we put the cherry bomb? Alright. Put in the gap! Okay! Wham! Six zombies go down, they go down without fire, and the wave is basically gone. We just put in their pea shoe right there, and that is an awesome, that is most, that was an awesome, you know, creation. You put a cherry bomb. Pretty creative, in my opinion. And now we got the shovel. Shovel can dig up plants, so if you actually plant a wrong plant there, you can dig it up, and usually they give you sun back. But yeah, guys, that's really going to wrap it up for this episode. Hope you guys enjoy this um, series. I'm going to love it. So um, we're going to get back to Crazy David. Crazy Dave looks really like he just freaking just took like 20 beers or something. Look at him. <laughs> but he's a pretty cool guy. But yeah, guys, that's great. I hope you guys enjoy the video. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out, y'all.